Hello everybody, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Let me introduce myself first. My name is Olivia Edminazem. I'm a student of University of Islam Majapahit, especially in at least education on six semester. Okay, now I'm going to present about my proposal. Okay, let me share about my proposal. Okay. Okay. The okay. The title of my proposal is the implementation of using gambits in speaking skills at 10th grade of SMA N1 Trawas. This is a descriptive qualitative study. Now, in my proposal, I have a three chapter. There are chapter one, chapter two, and chapter three. Okay. In chapter one, it's tell about the introductions. Okay. Background of the study. What is Gambit? Gambit in communication activity, we try to keep the conversation that we do with other fields uh, police in order to feel directly on subjects about problem and in order to not feel secure. So I want to tell you about the, uh, the meanings and the important things of Gambit. So Gambit is to help you, to help you about you want to start about the communications. So this is the name of Gambit. If you want to uh, start with communication or with your friends, with your parents, and then with your uh, sisters, brother, so you must do uh, to help you about the first communications uh, to cut conversation and to help you about the uh, communications, help you about the conversations, but speaking the name of the Cambit. Okay. Uh, why Cambit? This is the I have a three reasons why I have a gambit. One, mostly gambit is for beginning of conversation. Yes, it's true. Uh, gambit, it has the beginning of the conversations. For example, to help you about the first beginning of the conversations. And then uh, mostly gambit is the important skill like getting conversations started, keeping it going and ending. Yeah, usually the people is uh, confused about this first of uh, the the first of uh, speakings and the first of communication. This is the difficult how to uh, start about the communications. And then yes, this is the reason why Gambit is help you to get uh, to help you about the if you want to say something that you want to start communications and you difficult about that. This is Gambit help you to get a conversation with another. And the three, it's important that very can be it's available. The daily conversation, especially in classroom, generally as beneficial source. Yes, uh, in schools, in uh, classrooms, you must still have a uh, conversations one to another with your friends. This can be help can help you about uh, the conversations about something else. This can help you, uh, can help you about the starts of the communication. So this is the reason why I use a gambit, and then. Why speaking skill? Yes, in speaking skills, I have a three reasons. First is speaking is the most important aspect of foreign seconds of foreign language. Yes, this is speaking is the, the important aspects. Foreign language, foreign language, it is the important aspects. So, and the second is speaking in way the language system in manuscript to the use of the organ speech. Yes, in English, have a speaking, right reading, listening, and Writing, so uh, speaking is the important aspect. If you want to say something, if you want to express your idea, you must just say, you must to use uh, speaking. And uh, yeah, the speaking is the profile students with opportunity to practice a language with other students. Yes, it's a very important speak of, if you want to practice a uh, conversation with your friends, with your brothers, with your sister, brother, you must to get to, you must to, understands about the people say and then you must to get uh speaking get a sentence that the people say understands about what you say so this is the important aspect of speaking skill and then 
problem statement. Based on previous diagram about the recessive formula search question as follows. How is the implementation of student speaking in using Cambit and 10 grade of SM and Satsutrawas? Yes, this is my problem statement. How? How the is how the implementations of student speaking skills using Cambit's at 10 grade of SMAN 1 Trawas. And then the objective of the study, the aim of research is to study to find out of the implementation of student speaking in using Cambit at SMAN 1 Trawas. Yes, uh, between a uh, problem statement and then objective of, of the statement is much related one to another. My problem statement is how the implementations and then the objective of, of the study is the research is to study to find out the implementations. And then significance of the study. Yes, I have two significance of study. The first is for teachers. For teachers can provide some for information, especially in teaching speaking skills using Gambit. Of course, the, uh, the teachers have to get some information uh, about the speaking skills of using a Gambit. And then for students, for the students to increase and get some knowledge on the speaking ability of using this can be okay uh, the the teacher is can uh, the students have uh, get some informations and the uh, the teacher has have some informations and for students have some knowledge about that it's of course this is the more two significance of the study and then chapter two is literature review one is a theory of cambits uh, gambit, a concept of gambit, this is for part you know. Can be sometimes cause of expressions. Can be a communication activity we try to keep conversation that we do with other fields policy and are not fields directly on subjects about the problem. So gambit is some um, cause of expression, yes. If you want to say something, if you want to start communication with another friends, you want with another friends, not another friends too, with another friends, with another uh, parents, you must to get expressions. Yes, this is the name of Gambit. Start the expression start of communication is the name of concept of the Gambit. And then, uh, how to use the Gambit? As I already mentioned before, particularly there are some number of Gambit. Yes, this is the most important thing that you must to underline about how to use Gambit is about the practically. This is more important because practically is one of aspects that you, that you must to get attention about it. Uh, for example, between A, I have a sample about how to use Gambit in classroom. Uh, so for example, is between students A and then between students B get a conversation. The topic of the conversation is about a uh, procedure text. So, hello Olivia, uh, how are you? Do you know what is the meaning of procedure text? And then the B say that procedure text is blah, 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 blah. And then, yeah, this is the name of the conversation of the Gambit. So this is how to use Gambit. It's about the practice. And then the practice, it's not to uh, you your, to yourself, but you can do your with your our friends, with your fathers, your mother, and etc. This is the, the important aspect how to use Gambit. It's about, and then it's about practically. And then, Example of Gambit. Okay, the example of Gambit is for Mukris. Uh, greetings. Oh, for example, of Gambit is one is uh, greetings. So, do you know what is the meaning of greetings? Yes, in Indonesia, greeting is name is Sapaan. And then greetings have a two. These are uh, formal and informal greetings. Yes, this is the example of formal greetings. How are you? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, how are you? And then that's good and better. Yeah, this is the name of formal greetings. And then uh, I have an uh, example about the formal greetings. For example, between A and between B, conversations and how are you? Hello, good morning, how are you, Olivia? And then B said, uh, hello, I'm fine, how are you? Yeah, this is the formal greetings. And then, some informal greeting is, hi, how are you? How are you feeling? Fine, thanks, you. And you? Just one, where are you going? Hi, hello. Uh, I have a, the example about that. Uh, hi, Olivia, what are, you, oh, what are you going? Where are you going? And then, yes, I want to go to the market. 
So this is the example about uh, formal and informal greeting. So the only line that too much attention about uh, how how you can use formal and then uh, where you can use informal. If you want to start the conversation with your mother, with your parents, and then more than odd that you're uh, now, this you must to start with formal greetings yes uh, and then if you want to start conversation with your friends and then with your uh, friends like uh, your uh, siblings you can uh, start with informal greeting that you must to uh, you know about the difference about formal and informal greetings you want to stay start about the formal greeting if you want to start with uh, start communication with your parents with uh, your uh, grandma, grandpa, this, you have to form a, and then informal, you have to start with your friends and then with your siblings that so you can to get informal greetings. And then theory of speaking, according to Nurjana, speaking is the skills of language that is important to be said, writing, reading, and listening. So this is the very important because between uh, speaking is the mind of teaching, speaking is enabled to students speak. And then the other uh, to can express the idea orally, and then uh, if you want to express uh, your idea, if you want to express your opinion, you can you, you can make sure of the speaking. It's a very important. And then without sense, say that the communication through speaking is commonly performed in face interaction and they occur part dialogue of verbal exchange. So uh, from Widowson say that speaking is communication through the speaking in with oral interactions and face interactions and between I and then between B of interaction and the gap of speaking. So this is the theory of speaking. And then component of speaking, yes, uh, the component of speaking that you want to attention about that is about the pronunciation. It's from Gilbert. The pronunciation is the way the student product clear. A, B, A, E, in Indonesian name is A, E, U, A, O, yes, yeah, this is the pronunciation. And then to grammar, yes, yeah, systematic why occur. This is for purpura, uh, systematic the language, systematic the sentence is about the grammar. And then vocabulary, yes, the vocabulary, you must to increase, of, of course, about your vocabulary. It is from Turk, it provides the important language, especially in speaking, yes. And then fluency, uh, the fluency is from poet. If you want to speak, in, uh, to speak in communicative fluency, accurately, fluency is a result to other language without interruptions. And then the last is comprehension. We found Cohen et al. Uh, coherence is a. Uh, I give you example about the coherence. So coherence is between uh, uh, a between sentence between sentence A and then between sentence B. It's must to get uh, uh, correctly one to another. It must to get uh, information one to another. So between A and between B is one to interactions one to another. For example. The, the, the easy example is about it. Olivia is studying right now. She is studying English. She's very like it. It refers to studying. Yes, this is the name of comprehension. So between another sentence it's, and then another sentence to it's must be connected one to another. Yes, connected one to another. And then implementations. An act of interest of implementing something, the process of making something active or effective. Yes, uh, in, my, in my title is the implementation. So this is the theory of implementation. It is to implementing some things. The process of making something, the process of making something, implementation of something. This is the name of uh, implementations. So this is from Maryam, uh, 1978. So I want to tell you about the preview study. Okay, Zakia, 2019, teaching, learning, speaking by using English conversation gambits, first step of SMK. So the first step in preview study is Zakia and with my uh, proposal, it's, yes, this is confusing using gambits of SMKN. I'm in SMAN. Yes, I'm in junior high school. Yes, I'm sorry, I'm senior high school. And then she at very 20 and 80 international general research in English education and she speaking fluency to conversation gambits routines among Iranian immediate. 
In the GS Bayesian communication is a two conversation campus. In in research English education and I just speaking fluency. In my uh, in the gap with my study is a uh, I'm study in a, ju a senior high school as I'm to to and then to get uh, some information and then the implementation not to uh, research English education and then you yeah, YGP, Gunawan S. V. Fitriani, 20 and 18 students can be and debate structure in national community and university West Java. So, in uh, the gap with my research, is uh, students can be debate with structure national, but in my research, it's a gambit to use in a uh, senior high school, and then it's not to debate this to get uh, studies about the gambit. And then the Adiani. Academy Juno English Education Coefficient can be used by the English Education Program students of graduate. Yes, graduate of uh, Padang and classroom discussion. No, I'm not a graduate, but I'm a uh, the real of senior high school. And then Agar Sharma, Sandy and Sandy can be for speaking capacity building of women. No, it's I'm not the, the I'm not about the capacity of uh, building women, but I'm a uh, real for students and for senior high school. So this is. Uh, five of previous studies and then I explain about the gap so and then uh, the first previous study it's uh, the gap is about uh, it's not to uh, learning campus of SMK but in SMA or senior high school and the GS Paradises can be is for conversation can be as well among Iranian immigrated no this is about in my gap it's uh, in my research it's uh, real for uh, students and then we GB it so as we as Sriani as students can be debate. No, I'm not a debate, but I'm real to studies of Cambits in students and then the Adriani Academy Juna used by English education program of Pascal graduate. No, postgraduate. I'm real for student and then the five uh, the last is capacity of woman. No, I'm not uh, not only a woman's uh to best of facility. American Journal, but uh, this in cap study is about real for students on senior high school and then real of using a Cambridge for senior high school. And then the chapter three, uh, research method. The first is, is the research is descriptive qualitative research, which means it intends to find out the descriptive outcome, the collect data, and interruptions of which at the conclusion. So uh, I use a descriptive qualitative method. So the name is descriptive qualitative method is intent to find out to find out uh, and then the collecting of the data and to find out. This is the name of a descriptive qualitative research. And then Subject of the study, the English teacher and students tend to create some uh, in Saturday. So my uh, subject of study is uh, English teachers and then the students on the 10th of SMA and Saturday. So I, I want to uh, go to do the, the English teachers and then on one of the students and the students of 10th of SMA and Saturday. And then search of data informs the English teacher and the student at 10th grade of SMA in Satutrawas. Okay, of course, this is the informant is of course, it's skill for I used to uh, students and then a teacher of SMA in Satutrawas. And then the events in classroom teaching activities. Yes, in it's uh, the event is teaching classroom activity when the when the teacher and students uh, get some knowledge and then the the teachers have some information about the gambits. So I used to go to the classroom and then I used I to research about oh, wow, how is the implementations of the uh, the gambits and using for uh, teacher and then the play for students. So this is the name of its events of search of the data. And then procedure of data collection. Uh, I use uh, three. The first is video recorder. Video recorder uh, to recording. It is the first step. I use a video recording to, and then I go to the classroom, and then I video the recording of uh, the 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 classroom activities and then observation checklist. There are three preparation about that. First is a preparation phase of tahap persiapan, Indonesian names of tahap persiapan, and the implementation phase, tahap pelaksanaan, and the research analysis, tahap analysis data. So the observation checklist is have a three that you want to attention is preparation, implementation, and result. Research. So the last in this interview, yes, the research interview, the teacher and 
uh, students of SMA and Satu Trawas, students of SMA and Satu Trawas. Yes, I want to interview about uh, with uh, the teachers about how you can apply the gambits in your classroom, and then I and then uh, how is the implementations, and then I use uh, about the how the implementation, and then how can you get uh, some knowledge about it. So I use uh, interview. Interview is for uh, students and then for uh, teachers. Okay, technique analyzing data is for Mels and Haberman 20 and uh, 14. Develop a model of data analyzing data is three. Data collection is refers to research collect to find out. Yes, the first you must do data collection to collect about your data that you want to get some uh, research about the observation of the data. And then data reduction is the process of selecting. You must do selecting about the data that you know about with your uh uh information for uh, students and for teachers and data display research the research can classify and the group select conversation that we analysis yes this is the, you must do analysis uh after you collecting after you reduction and then this last is you must do display you must classify about oh yes i want to uh uh select and conversation and analysis about a sentence yeah about this A and this B, if you must do uh, important things that you must do attention about it. So, technique analysis data is three, data collections, data reduction, and data display is for Mass and Haberman. Okay, technique validating data is validating where also verified the analysis process. So, this is the very first of the, uh, of the analysis process. It is a final stage. Yes, it's final stage after you get collecting the data, and then you, uh, and then you get a three about the data detection and the data display, and after, and like that, data data collection. I'm sorry, data reduction, data display, and then validating of the data. The validating of the data is you must validate about your uh, research proposal, and then uh, this is from pattern 19 and 99. So the validating of the data is the end of the uh, chapter three and then this is for reference my references okay and thank you very much okay um i think enough okay thank you very much that you much to attentions about my proposal uh thank you very much for your attention and uh, I'm sorry that my experience is not good or etc. But I hope you understand about my experience. Thank you very much for your attention and see you next time. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.